Are you absolutely sure about this, Toyvin? Absolutely certain, Oxen. If there was any other way, I'd consider it. Um, let's do it then. The stones are stable. Follow my lead. So, what do you know about the Aquanids? I'll tell you later. This is where we take a leap of faith. What do you mean? Hop on and find out. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, happy time zone, everybody. Welcome back to Hangan Animation. I'm Mike Jimmy Brown, creator of Love and Cora and CEO of Fairies and Ends. And welcome to me on my animation journey that I've been on for the last two years. Um, yeah, there's a little warning. The baby is awake and she is very active. Um, she also doesn't sound all too happy. So if my wife has to go into the living room to take care of her, I am sorry, but you'll have to do with it. Uh, and that means that I mute because the baby comes first. Um, that being said, welcome, welcome. Last week, we did all the coloring on the characters. Or let me grab the proper scene. This one. Our friend Benville went out to explore somewhere far away. We fear he has not survived the journey, but we hope to find him and see what happened. Will you assist us? So we're going to be finishing up that one. I cleaned up the uh, frames that didn't um, look proper. Um, where there's, you know, the mouth wasn't colored in, stuff like that. Um, as well as the second part of the scene. Let me move to the end here. I colored him as well. Like, minor work. It's it's not that much work, but it, it needs to happen, right? So, did all of that in between. But, today we're going to be working on the background. Also, I just want to bring a huge shout out to my um, wonderful Patreon supporters because you guys actually went pretty hard. So a huge thank you to the Five Dollar Creator Creator um, tier uh, members. And right now you can find um, the poll for it on what creature we will be walking on Korra next um, over on uh, this link. And be sure to check it out. It would mean a lot if you would put in your uh, answer and follow me. You don't have to become a member in order to join this one. The future ones, you know, they're going to be Patreon rewards. But for now, be sure to join in. I would love that. Um, and next up, Let's get to work, because there is a background that needs to be drawn. Sorry if you can hear the baby in the background. I don't think you can. Uh, let me check, actually. Um, maybe. I'm sorry if you can hear the small one. Uh, and who do we have here? Donna, how are you doing? Hey, Dan. Hope you all are doing good. It's good to have you. Now, let's go and make a background. So, the background is only one solid thing. So, I can just make it one folder. And it is already the way I like it, though. He, this needs to be a little bigger, so. Take the lasso tool and go. Wrong layer of crunk. So, more like this. Hey, I'm Don. Hope you're doing good. Welcome, welcome. All right. So, honestly, what I'm going to do, because, okay, let me just 
check something. So I got the camera over here. And the furthest it will be out. Actually, you can go way out. Because So yeah, that is a lot better. I turn those off again, and that means that the background can be transformed because they are not nearly that big compared to the thing they're standing on. Yeah, something like that. All right. And we go all the way back down. Actually, let me close that, close that. There we go. Now we have some oversight on what we actually need to do. And let's see. I think it's that one. That's it. Yeah, there we go. And I got to make it black. Higher stabilization makes life easy. Just like that. Now, oh, when I have those guys visible for a second, Oop, there they go. I don't like what it's doing why don't i like what it's doing because the pressure is off yeah that's not like it let's see the witzman dude made the mistake of doing our taxes and is now stuck in tax hell he'll be here asap uh, it's important make sure you get those finished Trust me, a live show is not is nowhere near as important as getting your taxes in order. It's not going to be as fun, but you know, something, something priorities. So, happy belated Valentine's Day, by the way. To anyone who celebrated it, personally, my wife and I skipped it because we love each other as, as it is. And we've been married for less than half a year, so there is literally nothing to prove. <laughs> In all honesty, we just love each other. And uh, if we really want to take that, Uh, I think I'm going to move it like this. Yeah. And you might be thinking, why? Well, that grounds them back in, oh, in this place which means it shows where they come from. Ooh. And that is the wrong tool. I have had a pretty long day. Um, Luz has been away to take care of, uh, well, she's been to her first work day since her maternity leave. And so um, I've had Aurora all day and I have been struck with the flu since this weekend. Well, since Monday, really. Um, so, yeah, I'm still a bit under the weather. Um, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm not doing too bad. Just, yeah. Still a little under the weather. Gonna be fine. Uh, and 
and then I got to open. Let me see. Image file scenes. Scene. One that shakes because I want the same kind of colors all over. That one, and I want it to be filled up. Well, same or as a reference layer, and can just whoop or not. Oh yeah, doesn't work if you're on the reference layer. Yeah, that can be the same layer. That's fine. Here we go. Oh, that should be. A different color because it's a rock. Well. Gonna make that separately, really. It's been a while since I've made that scene, so um no. Hmm. Okay. Weird. Here we are. We create a multiply layer. Well, wash. Doesn't overflow. There's some blues and some greens. And these can be pretty messy, like it's. Uh oh, that's a mess to clean up. Okay. Is there a little beer? Yeah. There we go. So anyway, how's everyone's week been? I have been well sick, but other than that, I've actually been pretty good. So yeah, got Patreon on the way. Huge shout out to my first two patrons. You guys rock. And I appreciate you madly. And if you want to get previews on everything we do every week and the results of today, tomorrow, uh, immediately instead of waiting for next week, I suggest heading on over on the link that I just shared. And checking this out on Patreon. Oh, now we gotta come into the background. OK. 
actually do. I want to separate that. So, don't, at least don't overlap. That is way nicer. <laughs> Whoops. All right. Let me go and turn on the camera. There we go. I'll turn on the keyframes, not the camera. God. There. There we go. Let's see how that actually looks properly rendered. Scene one dash seven test four. Let's see. Do not celebrate holidays on the day besides or Valentine. Yeah, exactly. That that's how I do it. That, that that's my mentality too. Uh, to be able to do celebrate it, good on you. Have fun. So while this is loading, I have a cover reveal for the next life on Cora. So for people who don't know, um, Life of Korra is a series of comics where we explore all kinds of creatures on an alien world. A couple of years ago, I imagined the world and I told a couple of writers, go, go have fun in my sandbox. Think about what lives on it. And so they did six times already. Well, technically seven because I'm nearly done with seven and even more times than that, because I've got scripts ready up to issue 13 or something. But, um, yeah, they came, they saw, they played it around in my sandbox, and they made a lot of uh, really cool stories. And the next one is essentially ready. Um, I only have to ink one single page. <laughs> And then my colorist has to do 16 more pages, so it's halfway. And as such, I would like to do a little cover refill because I'm really proud of it. And my colorist was very enthusiastic and finished it in a night as well. And I think you guys should see it. So here we go, and that is a nice little name reveal as well. Life of Korra 7 is going to be called The Bond. Um, yeah, that logo is a derp, and I need to put the subtitle lower. That'll come as it comes. But yeah, let me know what you think. I'm pretty proud of it. Um, I'm very much looking forward to sharing it to proofreaders and stuff because it is a wonderful story. It is by the same writer as La Foncora 4. So Inner Talents, uh, Kimberly Kovac, and she does a 
really well done emotional stories um, through a very strong character driven narrative. And this story is no different. And if you don't know her, um, she is Silver Lugia 249, if I recall correctly, over on Tapas. And she's a really good writer and a web novelist. So be sure to check her out. Yeah, I love it too. It's it's great. All right, I am rendered. I'm going to leave this open for a minute. And then I can upload the newest scene. So yeah, there is a preview available on the Patreon as well for this issue. Uh, I know a lot of people have watched it on Facebook as well. And I would love to know what you guys think. All right, so here's another finished scene. Our friend Benville went out to explore somewhere far away. We fear he has not survived the journey, but we hope to find him and see what happened. Will you assist us? Uh, so I see that I missed an eye. You guys probably did too, which means that I have to find it. Which is kind of a pain. But not the end of the world, because we can just... Do, 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 do. I just forgot to fill in the whites. It happens. Ba, 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 da. Oh, there it is. Up to white. And... Just like that. Now I just got to make sure it's all the same. I ah, see there's another one. These happen. They're not the end of the world. Just got to make sure you fix them on the spot. Yeah, I think that solved it. Yeah, there it is. There we go. This is the first time I'm doing it like this, and that makes way more sense. Well, the more you learn. All right. That is not clean. Not that anyone would notice that quickly, but. And I'm going to save it just at the same. Yeah, it's going to be the same name, but that's okay. Like minor differences, right? The point is that we're done. Woo, that's another scene down. All right. Let's go through scene dash eight. Okay. Yeah, that's going to have to give it a retake but for Nita, but So Is that something like he's not? Yeah. 
Let me share my sound because I had it muted because otherwise you hear the echo. And that's where it came from, guys. I finally found out where, why. I don't think anyone heard you. Nothing is happening. Patience, give it a moment. Yeah, we don't have that in yet. <laughs> All right. So There we are. So the thing here, right? So the first movement is fine. This this works, right? But there's no slowdown here. So I'm gonna move these. Go ahead. Because there needs to be a 2A, which is barely overshooting. So what that does And yeah, I'm going to um, remove the temporary ones. I'm going to redo those. At least where I have to, right? But um, here. And no. Let me go back to. There we go. And that means that after one, it needs to be new animation cell as well. It finishes up this motion. And that just creates that, that stop. And now fast things move fast, which means they. And skip frames.
Just like that. Whee! Gotta move that head. Yay. This perspective is off. Because it's essentially a middle. I don't. We're going to get this uh, face into there. And I think one A could okay, B. This definitely needs to be its own thing. And again, these are quick. They don't have to be solid. They just, they just need to follow the motion. Just make the edge a little smaller. So they were a bit too big. That was fine. Now I'm missing. I'm missing something in between these two. Okay. So that motion between those two is too big. So I'm actually going to do. Delete that. Because then I don't have to worry about too many frames. I want the new animation. So, in between these two. Because you literally want to make in betweens. And now it feels too slow. That needs to stay there. And now I want to copy. Paste. Right. I want one B. Is that layer two? Yes. A. And 
not want to paste. There we go. Hey, how are you doing, Nita? Hope you're doing good. No, no, I'm totally dork. She she knows exactly her her um audience. All right. What is what is there some? That needs to be made up of here too. Ah, oh, I see. B two B two two A two B three. Where is that? Let's see. First of all, you're too big. That doesn't help. There we are. Uh, I think this looks okay. This is the first time I'm doing a shaking head. All right. Uh, I'm kind of liking that. Oh, let me. I didn't do anything to this, I think. I did do a lot here. Ah, no. The same as well. Okay. Let's see. I don't think anyone heard you. Nothing is happening. 
Patience. Give it a. Mm -mm -mm. Hey, welcome back from TechSec. Oh. Even managed to confuse two TurboTax sector, whatever. That just means you did a good job because let's be honest, normally they could just confuse us. All right. So is it shaking it? No. I'm not going to do the track label today. Do I have anything? That's a work in progress that I can do with you guys. Uh, oh, yeah, I was working on scene 3 2. This is nothing. They get even better, especially higher up. Yeah, because three does three. Oh! This isn't the first time I've ridden on an aquanet. Really? So what do you know about them? Or is this another surprise for later? This isn't the first time. Yeah. Uh, that's lip syncing mainly as well. Since I'm not feeling too well, I'm uh, going to take it easy. Uh, but I think I don't have easy at this moment. Uh, no, actually. That's kind of annoying. Because, um, yeah, in that case, I'm going to cut it short. I'm very sorry, but I, I'm feeling under weather. Aurora is um, not being the nicest to lose right now, from what I'm hearing from, the, uh, from across the wall. Um, and I'm going to uh, help her out because she's had a very long day at work, finally uh, getting back to work since this week, and she deserves their time off. She's been walking around a lot, a lot more than she's used to. Uh, dude, if you were feeling bad, you could have just took off. I know, I know, I could have. But um, I'm enjoying this. Like, that's the thing. Like, this is one of the best parts of my job. And, uh, yeah, I appreciate y'all. So, uh, yeah, thanks again to my awesome patrons. There we go. Link is in the description. You can be a builder for $1 and a creature creator for $5. And if you... Let me see. Let me... Oh, crawl up to the top. Let me do that one. Scroll up to the top. You will find a link to a Patreon post where you can vote for the next creature on Life on Korra that we will draw. So we got four votes so far. Come be the fifth. Would be appreciated. Uh, let's see. Dan says, I may irritate my CPA with all the retirement financial stuff, especially next year when you have to pay taxes on the 401k withdrawal. I have to admit. I don't even want to get into that. Oh boy. Thanks, Carl. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. Um, just, yeah, got to stick it out. 
yeah, I'll get better. No worries. I'm, I'm around. I'm, I'm, I'm feeling better than the start of this week. It's just been, uh, it's been a bit. And Aurora hasn't been feeling too well either. Definitely, definitely caught it from her. I just dropped a pen. Um, yeah, of course, I take care of my myself and my family. That's that's what I'm doing it for, right? All right, lovelies, thank you so much. You were awesome as always. Um, and again, next live on Cora cover. And I will see you all on the next Hangan Animation next week. Thursdays, 1 p.m. Eastern or 7 p.m. Central European time, which is my time. That's why I say good morning, good evening, good afternoon, and happy time zone. <laughs>